Debs from Soul Harmony Yoga. How are you doing? Are you ready for a five minute class to strengthen through the legs and through your ankles and to find some balance and focus? We're going to go through Vratsana, the tree posture. So let's get going. So you just need a yoga mat. That's all you need, or just a space on the floor. You don't need anything else. Okay, let's just travel down to our feet for a couple of seconds and just feel our feet, just feeling your feet really connected down to the space that you're stood on in the earth. And just finding some length through your body as you soften into your knees, softening the belly, just taking your shoulders up, beautiful. Great. Okay, let's just start to waken the body up now. We're a little bit more present in it by shaking through to your wrists, into your elbows, and up. That's it. And just circling your arms around. Let's just ease your shoulders out. So in my classes, we always go through a few warm-ups first. Again, really easy warm-ups. And the reason that we do that is to just allow your body to start to prepare for the yoga postures that we're getting into. So let's move over, take the weight to your left foot and just start to shake out your right foot. You may want to just rotate your foot one way and the other. So just shaking out. I hope you like my pants. My friend Katrina sent them me for my birthday. And they're just so comfy. They're great yoga pants. Bending into your knee and then into your hip. If you need to, just holding onto a chair or holding onto the wall. Beautiful. And then just placing that foot back down, just give you the leg a shake, it's aching a little. We're gonna open up your right hip now. And I want you to, we're doing this because in the posture for the tree posture, we really, it's a great hip opener. So let's just take the knee up, take it out. And back around again you can hold on to something not make it your yoga practice harder than it needs to be it's not about struggling it's about recognizing that you need support and giving yourself that support one more time beautiful let's do the same on the other side just shaking out your left foot just warming your legs up for this great posture and through to your knee and then into your hip just swing you're just checking there's nothing behind you it's a really lovely posture to start your day actually because it's great for just focusing positioning your foot down just giving your right leg a shake okay let's open that left hip let's take the knee up open out and try and keep you can see my body's moving try and keep your opposite hip facing forwards because otherwise we just sort of end up turning and the hip doesn't open so just really circling the leg round one more time beautiful shaking through okay let's go through the arm movements with a really easy balance to start with so I'm going to take your right foot and just position your heel onto your right ankle and you can see that my leg is just the hips just open slightly my hips are facing forward let's draw in the abdominal muscles to create a bit of core strength awareness to your hands we're going to inhale raise the arms up let's exhale and come down to your heart center inhale arms turn forward exhale let them come forward inhale arms come back exhale foot to ground hands come down by your side let's do that on the opposite side so left foot into right heel hips are facing forward so awareness to your hands inhale hands above the head any blood pressure issues just bring your hands a little bit lower down Exhale to heart center. Inhale, arms turn forward. Exhale, hands come out in front. Inhale, 
and exhale. Okay, so you've got the arm movement. There's a second option for your foot that you can position your foot just below the knee. Okay, so it's a bit slippy with my pants on. And you really need, you can see I'm kind of wobbling. I'm on my right leg that's not quite as strong as my left. So I'm going to engage my core and just really feel some strength down the leg. So that's where you can position your foot, should you wish, rather than balancing here if you want a bit more of a challenge. So do you want to just try that now? Just try positioning your foot, see how you go. Abdominal muscles are drawn in, just lengthening through. Beautiful. The other trick to this is to find a point to gaze to down towards the floor so that you can really keep your balance and just let your eye um, vision just drop towards something that is fixed and not moving. Okay, let's exhale and draw the abdominal muscles back. Awareness to the hands, positioning your foot wherever you would like. We're going to inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Opposite side. Inhale. And exhale. So we're just going to keep flowing with these movements. Inhale. For the next few rounds of the posture. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Opposite side. Just working with your breath if you know the movement. So we inhale. Exhale down to hop. Inhale. Whoops, then you might just have a keel over. Don't worry. Exhale. Falling forward. Inhale. Exhale. One more time on each side. Inhale. Exhale. I need to find my fixed point. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, keeping my core engaged to really exhale, support my balance. Final time. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Beautiful. Exhale. And then just closing your eyes. And with each exhalation, just breathe out through your feet. And as you begin to inhale, breathe in from your feet to your heart. And then we're going to exhale from the heart to the crown of the head and into the sky above. Inhale from the crown of the head to your heart. Exhale down through the feet. I'm going to repeat that once more. You inhale, breathing up through your feet to your heart. Exhale, take your awareness from your heart to the crown of your head and beyond. Inhale through the crown of your head. And exhale, down through your feet. Mentally preparing for the rest of your day as you allow your breath to return to normal. Just bring in your hands if you wish, either into prayer position or resting on your heart, just connecting into your heart center. Beautiful. Just giving gratitude for taking just these few minutes to really center and balance yourself for your day. And then allowing your hands to drop down when you're ready. Thanks for joining me and have a beautiful day. Thank you.